channel. This is my new adventure. <laughs> Got a 2013 KM oh, XT 1000. It's my first time driving it. So far, it seems to be a pretty good machine. But uh, the dislike is, you know, it's, you get, it's kind of crampy for, you know, I'm six feet, 230. In the winter time, you wear a bundle up a little extra, so it's a little tough. But if you want more movement, I say, this is the way to go. But if you don't mind being cramped in a little, you know, a little more protection, I say the uh, side by side is the way to go. But uh, it's my only first day owning one, first time driving one. So I'm just gonna experience and see what happens. I think it gents. This is uh, the 2018 Rubicon 500. Uh, comes with the independent suspension, power steering. And this is the first time being in Bruderheim. Yeah, yeah my this first is time. her first time, yeah. So, so far, she's doing good. I'm so, it. Yeah, yeah. So Please she, like and subscribe. Please <laughs> like and subscribe, yeah. And you can hit the notification bell down below. Oh, nice. <laughs> Can Am Commander 1000. Can Am Commander 1000. XT. XT. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. This is from Am. Try it again. Try it again. That's not very good. Can Am. 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 1000 XP. Commander. Is it a uh, UTV? Yeah. Um, okay. You speak for me. No, no, no. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to our channel. This is uh, Bobby. Hi, this is Bobby coming from. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I get it. I'm from Canada and I'm from Philippines. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I get it, I get it. Get it. Uh, one. Two, three, from Edmonton. Hi, this is Bobby coming from Canada, Edmonton, Alberta. And this is my friend here coming from the Philippines. She yes. came to <laughs> her to visit and she's stuck here, but that's okay. We got some stuff for her to do today. Uh, yesterday we purchased a used 2013 Can-Am Commander 1000. We're out today taking it for a test drive. So far, so everything seems to be pretty good. It's a little tight, you know, but Kind of a big guy, I'm not that big, six feet, 30, you know, but it seems to run really well. The first time owning a uh, Can Am, uh, we used to own Honda, but it's definitely something different to drive. It has a lot of power, it has support edition, it has power steering. Uh, it's a really nice machine, you know, it has really a lot of get up and go, you know, but for anybody else, I don't think the 1000 is just, I think it's too much power for some people. Probably the 800 would be perfect, but that's okay. Well, we got a pretty good deal on it. Bought off an older lady, she was 70 when she purchased it, and she was on the acreage. So I think we were pretty lucky. Hasn't been driven very hard, it has 1300 kilometers on it. So, the people that we bought it from, they're really nice. You know, the older lady that owned it, she was really excited that she was passing it on to somebody else. Hopefully, we'll get to enjoy it as much as she did. So, so far, everything works great. We're in uh, Bruderheim, Alberta, Canada, taking it for a test drive. Uh, we're just driving around today just to see how it works. Uh, maybe next weekend we'll take it around a longer trail. We'll take it on, you know, two or three hundred kilometer trail next weekend. But we'll see. We just wanted to test it out, try the brakes, you know, check the belt, make sure everything is fine. So everything so far, everything seems to be pretty good. You know, I was surprised with the uh, with the tires around it. The, uh, the 
What are they? Uh, the Bighorn 2.0s actually got pretty good traction in sand. Right here in, right here in Alberta, here in Bruderheim, there's a lot of sand on the ground. So it's actually pretty good traction. My first time using these tires. So I think they're pretty good for the uh, areas that we drive. So, all right, Anna, would you have any questions about this machine today? What do you think about it? This is awesome. That's all. <laughs> think it's awesome? Yeah, I love to drive this one. Like to drive? Yeah. I I think this is something that you would drive or something a little bit small. You do like the uh, uh, like the, the players, the trail edition, you do like the 500 or the 570, you know, you do like, or the Honda, they got the, like the 500, ETV, the Pioneer, that'd be a good little one, you know. We even have the, uh, I drive my own personal vehicle. I have a Honda Rubicon 2018 500, power steering, independent suspension, and it seems to work great. We have the uh, a Bud Light. XT1, we have the Mud Light uh, 2 tires on it. The aftermarket to ITT steel rims. We have lots of traction, works great. You know, it doesn't have a lot of power. You know, it doesn't have a lot of power, but for what tray riding and stuff, it works perfect. You know, it works good enough for that. But, but if you want to keep up to the 800s or, or something with that more power, then you just can't do it. You tell the guys, hey, I'll see you when you get there. <laughs> you know, but besides that, like, well, what do you think about driving the. Uh, would you rather drive a side by side or would you rather drive an ATV? I'm enjoying that one. You're enjoying that one? Yeah. That's good. You know, if sometimes if you ever, uh, uh, how much do you weigh? You weigh about 150, right? <laughs> Let's try something funny. Come on over here. Come on. <laughs> Don't open the door. Lay down. Sit down. There we go. Hold on. It's like an ambulance, you know? It's nice over here. I can ride here. Yeah, so if anything ever happens. I know. You can dump her out. We got nothing to worry about. When we're done, we'll just lock her back in place and we're good to go. We got this nice one. So you got nothing to worry about. If you yeah. ever have trouble in the woods, we can throw you in the back and we're done, we'll dump you. <laughs> what do you think? Please like and subscribe. If you like and subscribe. If you're first Don't time trying nice. this, please hit the notification bell. Well, down. Down. down at the side, just like all everybody else does. We got the, uh, we'll put the, uh, what is it? A notification thing up top to be, uh, you know, and bell down below. <laughs> so. All right, thank you guys. That's nice. And uh, we'll see you on the trails. Maybe sometime we'll see you in Alberta, Canada. Look for us and we'll look for you. Okay. All right, thank you. Come again.
put it back into that other See that slot there? You have to pick it up. That means you can't clean it, right? So that means that you have to free for it. It's cool for you.